In this video, we're going to take a look at, once again, recording audio. However, the difference here is that with the most recent release of FL Studio, they have really streamlined the process of getting audio into your playlist. Before, there were a number of steps that you had to take when wanting to record audio. And now, the process has been scaled down to a single click of a button, hence the name of the process, One Click Audio Recording. But there are a few things you will need to make sure are configured correctly before this will work. The first is to make sure that you have your audio interface set up correctly for recording. FL Studio will only support recording with ASIO supported devices. If your card does not ship with a dedicated ASIO driver, then you may want to either consider purchasing a new card that does include an ASIO driver, or check out www.asio4all.com. Here you can download a freeware ASIO driver that has been designed to add ASIO support to almost any audio interface. Once your interface has been correctly configured, the next thing you'll need to do is to enable the input that you wish to record from. From FL Studio's mixer, select the master channel, then from the drop down input menu, select the correct input. And that's it. You are now ready to do one click recording. To perform one click recording, you only need to click on the one click recording icon in the toolbar. The countdown will automatically begin and recording will start. Once complete, click the stop button. The audio will be placed into the lane in the playlist editor. Nothing can be simpler. Once the audio is in your playlist, you can perform the usual tweaks to it. Perhaps this is the shortest instructional video we have made thus far. However, that just shows you how simple recording audio into FL Studio really is.